Hey, what's up everybody? It's Michael. And this is what's going on here at Byerly, December 2020. Before we get to it, if you haven't already, go ahead and subscribe to our YouTube channel and make sure you hit the bell icon so you get notified when we upload new videos. Now while you're at it, go ahead and check us out on Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter. And now to the update. Looking for a vacation adventure? Been planning that epic bucket list trip? Join us here on YouTube December 8th for Byerly RV University RV Rentals. The pros at Byerly RV will be discussing why renting an RV might just be the perfect answer for you. We will be live streaming this and all our Byerly RV University classes this year here on YouTube. To find a link to that upcoming live stream, check our YouTube channel or you can find it in the description below. Byerly RV will be closed for the holidays starting December 24th and will reopen on January 4th. For those looking to do some traveling during this holiday season and want to do it in an RV, we've made it easier than ever to get a hold of us. You can call, email, and text every department through our website. Can't make it out to the dealership, but still want to look at an RV? You can now request a personalized viewing experience from our website on any model of RV we have, and a member of our sales staff will video chat with you and walk you through the RV. For those who do come out to the dealership, we have put precautions in place to keep you and our staff safe during these unprecedented times. We are requiring all staff and customers to wear face masks, have frequent and thorough cleaning schedules, have installed shields at all counters, sanitize all vehicles that come in and when they leave our service department, sanitize all rental units, have a selection of sanitizing products available from our business office, and of course, we are practicing social distancing. And now here's Dave with December's featured RV. Thanks, Mike. Dave here at Byerly RV in Eureka, Missouri. There are some products that have stood the test of time here at Byerly RV, and the Wildwood Travel Trailer line from Forest River is one of those. I am in the Wildwood 29 V-Bud Travel Trailer, which is one of the best modern bunkhouse layouts I think you'll find. We have a spacious living room with versatile furniture. We have a kitchen with tons of counter space, the newest appliances, and more than enough pantry space. The bunk room has a queen bed on the bottom and two bunks above. The 29 V-Bud can accommodate not only a large family, but large families. I think you'll see that the 29 V-Bud in its price range is one of the best bunk houses out there. So to check out more, check out this video on our YouTube channel for all the demonstrations of the furniture and everything. I think you'll really like it. Now, back to you, Mike. As a local and family-owned business since 1948, we are proud when we see our communities shopping at and supporting their local businesses. Going on now through January 1st, when you shop at a local business here in Eureka, snap a selfie with the store's owners, staff, signage, or even their merchandise or food. Then post it on either Facebook or Twitter and tag the city of Eureka's social media pages and include the hashtag ShopEurekaMo and you'll be entered to win cool Eureka gear like hats, bags, water bottles, and stickers. For more info and a full list of local restaurants and stores, visit the City of Eureka's website at eureka.mo.us. Our parts and service departments are currently offering a 15% discount on parts and labor on bearing packs, max air cover installs, slide topper installs, awning fabric replacements, electric tongue jack installs and replacements, and Furion camera system installs when you schedule any of those services now through the end of February. All service appointments also include a free multi-point courteous inspection. And now here's Rick with your service quick tip. Hi, Rick here with your Barley quick tip of the month for service. So one of the things that I wanna address is something that I talked about uh, a month or so ago is the use of your black tank drain valve, all right? With the situation that's going on in the world right now, a lot of people are making extended stays, are actually living in your campers right now, and we're, we're seeing an issue develop where people are leaving their black valves open all of the time. And what that allows 
is for the liquids to drain out, but the solids stay in the tank, all right? When the solids stay in the tank, they build up because they cannot get flushed out. You have to keep that valve closed until that tank reaches approximately two thirds or a little bit more, and then drain the tank out to properly help to flush the solids out. Also, make sure you're using some kind of a bio digester in that tank to help break those solids up while it is setting. So just make sure you keep the valve closed until you're ready to dump. Um, the day before, close the gray valve. That way you've got something to kind of help flush the, the hose out after you've dumped the black tank, you dump the gray tank, you flush them out that way. So. Something else with living in the trailers and stuff like that over the winter time here. Um, get some kind of a wrap underneath along the bottom of the trailer, whether it's hay bales or just putting some plywood up or skirting or something. Put something around that. That will help from the air getting up underneath the trailer and it will help to keep the trailer a little bit warmer. You know, you still don't have a whole lot of insulation there, but it'll help to keep them a little bit warmer. Um, for those of you that are storing your campers during the winter, remember it's getting colder out there. It's time to seriously think about getting them winterized if you haven't done that yet. Um, take your batteries off, store them in the house over the winter time. If you can, keep a trickle charger on them, two amps or less for trickle charge. Um, and for those of you with motorhomes, remember go out about every 30 days or so, start the engine, start the generator. Uh, put a light load on the generator, just run the blowers to the air conditioners or something like that. The, air, the compressors won't run if it's cold out. Um, and just let fuel and, and uh, stuff circulate through the systems. That way they don't gum up during the, during the uh, uh, storage time during the winter time. So be safe out there and we'll talk to you next month. Back to Mike. If you're looking for even more RVing related videos, be sure to subscribe to our YouTube channel and hit that bell icon so you don't miss out when we upload videos like these monthly updates, RV tours, instructional videos, schools, interviews with industry insiders, and even fun little videos like our cooking show. And also watch out for when we do bonus live streams with Dave and Rick. As your camper sits in storage during the winter months, mold and mildew can develop that can cause odors and even sickness for you and your family. Microbe Repel from EcoPro Products is an environmentally friendly system that is a disinfectant and adds permanent protection to treated surfaces. It's 99.99% .99 effective against a broad spectrum of microorganisms, including strep, influenza, E. coli, salmonella, H1N1, MRSA, and norovirus. For more information on Microbe Repel, give our business office a call at the number on the screen or click the link in the show notes below. Our rental department has new floor plans coming in 2021. For motorized RVs, we are adding the Thor Motorcoach Ace 27.2 and the Winnebago Mini Winnie 25B. Both are great for large families or if the kids want to bring a friend, with the Ace having a seven person sleeping capacity and the Mini Winnie having a six person sleeping capacity. On the towable side, we are adding four new floor plans. The Forest River Wildwood X-Lite 24RL XL and 273QBXL, and the Keystone RV Passport 267BH and 292BH. For more information on rentals and what's available, give our rental department a call at the number on the screen or visit our website by clicking the link in the show notes below. Well, everyone, it sure has been an interesting year, and we just wanted to thank everyone who's been subscribing to our YouTube channel, watching and sharing our videos, and all the new people who have been embracing the RVing lifestyle. We're looking forward to bringing you even more video content in the coming year and are very excited about some projects we have planned. From all of us at Byerly, please have a happy holiday and a great new year. Until then, that's what's going on here at Byerly. Please stay safe out there and we hope to see you all soon. As always, to stay up to date on all our latest videos, go ahead and subscribe to our YouTube channel and click the bell icon so you get notified when we upload new videos. You can also like and follow us on Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter to stay up to date on any upcoming events, promotions, and news.